Welcome to Bake Gluten Free with Brittany. Today we're cooking up cheesecake. Preheat oven to 350 degrees. I'm gonna start making the crust with the gluten-free vanilla wafers. Put those into the Ninja blender. Take half a stick of butter and melt this in the microwave for 30 seconds to one minute. While the butter is melting in the microwave, let's crush the vanilla wafers. Crush the vanilla wafers on the Ninja Blender using the crush function. When the vanilla wafers have been crushed, you will want to remove the blade. Pour in the half of stick of butter that was melted. A fourth a cup of sugar. Mix this all together. In a spring form pan, pour in the crust. Press the crust down to make sure that it is covering the entire bottom of the pan. Bake the crust for 10 minutes. While the crust is baking, let's make the cheesecake filling. I'm going to use the KitchenAid mixer to make the filling. Three cream cheese. One small can of evaporated milk. One cup of brown sugar. One teaspoon vanilla. Gluten-free all-purpose baking flour, one tablespoon. Three eggs. Using the flat beater, we're going to mix all of this together. You want to mix this for several minutes because you want it to be a creamy texture. Once you're done mixing, it's about time to take out the crust from the oven. Pour the filling on top of the crust. Bake for one hour. After the one hour of baking, you will remove the cheesecake from the oven and let it cool down. Once it is cool, you will leave it in the fridge overnight. The next day when you are ready to serve, Cut up fresh strawberries to put on top.
Add strawberries to a bowl and half a cup of sugar. Stir that around and coat all the strawberries. This cheesecake recipe is a family recipe given to me by my mom. I have taken a few things and changed it up to make it gluten-free. When you are ready to serve, remove the spring from the pan so that you can cut it into slices. Add the strawberries on top. Enjoy, dinner is served. Thank y'all for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe and let us know if you tried cooking up some cheesecake.